tonight we're going to be talking about the sample distribution of the sample means in this video. Alright, what is all that saying is just find the mean of the sample means and the standard deviation of the sample means. Most of the time you're going to be given what mu, the population mean is, and sigma, the population standard deviation. So you just have to find out what the mean of all those samples would be. Alright, so for example, we have the average weight of mountain lions is 91 pounds with a standard deviation of 28.0416 pounds. We know that weights of mountain lions are normally distributed. That's going to be really important. Remember that you have to have a sample size greater than 30 or you have to know that our variable is normally distributed. Anyway, let's find the distribution of the sample mean of samples of size 6. Well, since we know that they're normally distributed, it doesn't matter that we have such a small sample. We know that mu of x bar, the mean of our sample means, will equal the population mean. Population mean is 91, based on our information. Sigma of x bar is sigma over the square root of n. You need to take this step by step and round each number to four decimals in order to get the same number as what you're expected to know on your homework. So if we look at sigma, we know that that is 28.0416. We have to find the square root of n. Well, n is our sample size, 6. So we have to find the square root of 6. The square root of 6 is 2.4495. Round it to four decimal places. Now we take these two numbers and divide, and we see that our standard deviation of our sample means is 11.4479. And that is all there is to finding the distribution of the sample means.